Hey guys, how y'all doing? This is Tyler Austin with MyGeekCentral.com. Today we're going to go over the basic layout of a web page, okay? And it's going to look just like this right here. And that's where we're going to end up with. So we're going to go ahead and clear that out. Alright. What you're going to want to do is you want to save your file. Index.php. Okay. You're going to want to save it to your exam folder. Okay. Create a new folder within your exam folder, your htdocs, and name it my first website. It's per perfectly acceptable. And go ahead and save it as index.php. All right. Cool. After you get that done, we're going to start typing up our basic web page right here. Okay. HTML. We're telling the browser we're going to be typing HTML. We're going to be closing in HTML. Okay start to finish it's basically what we're telling the browser start reading stop reading alright so now after we got our HTML head started we're gonna head type in head we're gonna close our head within our head we are going to have our title which our title is this right here it's what the web Web browser is gonna basically tell the name of the bait. This the name of the page basically. Um, so don't put anything random in there. It's, it's you know it is um, pretty key to someone telling what what web browsers they have up inside of their uh, well their or what web pages they have up inside of their web browser. So we're gonna name this my first site. Okay. And then also within our head we have to have our link which is going to link it to our style sheet but for right now we're not going to worry about this so I'm going to go ahead and take that out as copied and pasted that from my other one so I didn't have to type it okay so what this is saying is reference this to a reference this to a style sheet the type is text slash CSS this basically means that we're going to be typing CSS all right and then close link okay or yeah cool so we open the link, we close the link, and this is where we're going to actually be typing in all of our borders and all that good stuff. So now, after we type in our link, we're going to go ahead and close our header. We got it done. Cool. Next, you're going to want your header. I just said header. I meant to say head. I'm sorry. Open your header. Close your header. I'm just going to put this in and I'll explain all this in the next tutorial. Okay. Awesome. Basically, we just made a, a heading inside of our header. I just wanted to put some text in there. We're going to be making a border and everything, or we're going to be making an actual header with Photoshop and everything. So don't worry about that right now. I'm just doing it so you can see the content of the page. Cool. All right. Next is our body. We want to close our body. Last but not nearly least our footer and we're going to close our footer I just want to show you how the web page breaks this all down okay basically you just made the top of the page all the way to the bottom of the page okay body content we're going to add a little content in the body make a header again of the page just so you can understand what a header is we're going to name it blah blah <laughs> slash h3 you always gotta close you always gotta close you can't open it and then leave this one open or else all the content underneath of it is gonna be all scrambled okay I'm gonna make a paragraph P stands for paragraph and we're just gonna type random stuff in there and close the paragraph okay cool so we're gonna go ahead and save this alright go back to our browser go ahead and type in local host slash my first site slash index dot php enter there we go that's our header here's our paragraph blah 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 there's or there's our header for our paragraph blah 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 okay there's our, our paragraph content and there's the footer of the page and if you if you can use your imagination you can view okay this is gonna be our whole header right here okay we're gonna make it 960 pixels by 150 pixels 
and then we're gonna have our main content of the page which is within the body and we're gonna have all of our paragraphs and everything in there and it's gonna be awesome and then we're gonna have our footer and it's gonna just have our same thing as our navigation bar which we'll get into navigation bar a little bit later okay for right now and don't worry about it okay basically header navigation bar this is all of our body content right here and then this is our footer be sure to check out mygeekcentral.com subscribe post comments below um, I'm in a kind of a rush right now it's New Year's Eve I'm getting out of here um, y'all have a good night happy New Year's and uh, look forward to seeing y'all in the future tutorials stick with me thanks bye